Warning, this video contains flashing images. Welcome back to my channel everybody, I do very much appreciate each and every one of you actually dropping by. Welcome to my playlist of reacting to scary videos from YouTube. Can we debunk any of these videos? Are any of these videos genuinely scary? Or are they a load of baloney and completely hoaxed? Hey, let's find out. Like, comment and subscribe my friends. Like, comment and subscribe. Here we go. Let us start the video. Welcome one and all. Welcome back to my channel. Very much appreciate each and every one of you coming back here again. Right, here we are. We are now on the second part of the latest project video shall we debunk anything is this as bad as the first video was hey, just in case it is a wee dram of whiskey here because i know how bad the last video was it was all a bit pretty loud wasn't it it wasn't really my taste unfortunately loud 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 that's all i heard anyway shall we continue yeah i think we shall right hopefully this one's good enjoy this is the most demonic location in all of England. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh! I saw something, I swear to god. Hello? There's said to be a seven foot shadow. What the? Yo. I'm at the beginning stages of like something really affecting me. very dramatic at start isn't it it's very very dramatic uh, it puts your mind a bit -hoo -hoo -hoo, a bit scary a bit uh, loopy yeah i like the start of that so far it's a uh, it's hyped up isn't it this video is only 50 minutes long so that's good uh, the last one was about an hour it was over an hour anyway i remember that because i had trouble uploading the whole thing to youtube because i'm not partnered i can only upload just under an hour content so yeah i had to highly edit that video Looks like it'll be the same in this video. Anyway, shall we continue? I think we blimmin' well should. Everybody, welcome back to Project Fear. This is part two at the Ancient Ram Inn. This is said to be the most demonic haunted location in all of England, and it's lived up to its name tonight. We have had so much evil encounters. It's called out Alex specifically tonight. To Alex. Maybe it's got the hots for Alex, you never know. Tanner's camera completely shut it down and broke his camera earlier. We've never had a camera break. It's busted. If you saw the end of part one... It could be easily you know explained, couldn't it, the camera break? Stop. If you miss part one, you have to go watch it. The link is in the description. Whatever's here is definitely getting the best of us. And it's been one of the darkest nights we've ever had. There are still two spots in the ancient Ram Inn that we have not explored. The barn and the attic. Myself and Alex, we're gonna go up to the attic. And Tanner and Chelsea, you guys are gonna go to the barn. I mean, when we separated in the first part, that's when everything ramped up, and now we're separating even more. I'm only expecting the worst now. All right, let's go in. Alex, me and you. Let's go. Let's go to the attic. Let's get it, Chelsea. Yes. Yeah. Heck yeah, dream team. Let's go. Scream team. Scream Same team. Team. Dude. Yeah, I have to say, the attic does sound quite scary, doesn't it? Yeah, the whole... Ooh, boogie boogie, the attic and all that. It, is, it does kind of give off scary vibes in your mind, doesn't it? But is it going to be scary or is it just going to be all complete rubbish? I guess there's only one way... Ugh, sorry, I can't even talk. I guess there's only one way to find out there. Is probably not listen to me. Oh, dearie me. This is not going very well so far, is it? I do apologise. Anyway, let's see what happens. Okay, up to the attic. Oh, man. It just feels bad up here. Dude, I feel like I can't walk up here. It's hard to convey, but like the floorboards are all lopsided. The ceilings are not high. This is probably the highest ceiling. I can actually stand in here. That's the attic for you, my friends. That's the attic for you, isn't it? No, we technically don't Let's see what happens have here. To go back in. We could just hang out out here, but these grounds are probably pretty haunted too. Shit. I don't think we can escape it this time. No. I, have, I honestly have a really horrible feeling about what's about to happen. All right. All right, let's do it. To the barn. 
You know what? What if nothing happens? That'd be a waste of a video, wouldn't it? Wait, we're locked up. No, out. they definitely wouldn't have locked it. No, why would they? No, they. Hold on. What? Yo, this is Yo, weird. Yo, what the hell? What the heck? We got locked out. We got locked out. It does say one of us can go up at a time because the stairs are too weak, so I'll go up first. Okay, good luck. That's so sketchy. <gasps> oh. Surely if only one oh, could yeah, go up the stairs, that's a health and safety issue. So should this place really be open? Oh, man. If that's a health and safety issue, All you know? Right, oh, this is funny. I can see them outside hey, still. Hey, guys, we're locked out of the building. What? What? Wow. I literally can see her right now. We are completely locked out of the building. Are you sure? Legitimately. Swear to God, we are locked out of the building. All right, uh, we're going to come open it. How does that happen? I don't know. The door locked behind them. Oh, that's so it's an old house, guys. These sort of things do happen, don't they? These sort of things do happen. It's easy to get locked out of a building. Come on. It's an old house. You expect these things to happen, like I said before. What do you think? Do you think that's confusing? Or do you think they just made that up? Legitimately. Swear to God, we are locked out of the building. All right, uh, we're going to come open it. How does that happen? I don't know. The door locked behind them. That's so weird. No. Unless it just locks, but we've been going in and out all night. Yo, we're literally locked out. How? I don't know. Oh, yeah. What the hell? Dodgy lock, guys. It's a dodgy lock, isn't it? That's all it is. Just a dodgy lock. It's never locked behind us, but maybe, maybe we just shut it too hard. I don't know. I don't know. Is that them attempting to debunk there? Is that what they're trying to do there? Good. Good point there. They're trying to debunk some things. This is a massive attic. What's back there? Oh my god, it's another room. I didn't even notice that. Okay, so we have this bedroom area, and then this. I know in the attic, one of the innkeepers back in the day, it's believed that this is where his daughter hung herself. And people have seen that figure of her hanging. Oh, man. I bet that's not a very pretty sight, then, eh? And quite morbid. But is that true, or us? is that just hearsay? Is that just a story? We've been told that you drag furniture and move furniture up here. At some point while we're up here, or even right now, can you move one of these pieces of furniture up here? Can you try to use your voice so that we can hear it? Are we going to hear somebody's stomach rumble, maybe? Maybe it's my stomach. Since there's a lot of motion-related stuff up here, I think we should try the music box, which is a device that picks up motion. It's activated only by motion. Not all that convinced about the music box at all, if you ask me. All these things they do in these shows uh, I've not been proven, have they? They're pseudoscientists, I'll call it. It's not it's not fact based, it's just suggestion. Anyway, what do, what do you all think? Do you think I'm making any sense there? Probably not. Anyway, maybe it's time to continue, isn't it? Let us go. Let's see what happens in the second part of this Project Fear episode. <laughs> When something walks in front of this, it'll play a creepy tune just like this. I'm gonna aim it towards. You know what? They're not wrong about creepy tune. Gee whiz, that was quite creepy. Same dude. Okay. This is kind of the one area of the house where there's still a lot of mystery as to who could still be up here. Can you go onto the ground here, next to this box on the ground, and step in front of it? It'll play a song. We know 
the innkeeper's daughter ended her life up here. But we want to invite you into the room to come have a conversation with us. Can you walk in here with us? How kind. They're inviting her to come in and talk to them. Is it not kind of them? Do you think that the innkeeper's daughter was being oppressed by, like, this demonic force here? She had to get, be at such a low point to do that, to take her own life. Like, what if she was being oppressed? We know, like, Mr. Humphreys, the more recent owner, he had a lot of dark oppression stuff happen here. With the word hematos that we got, that's saying that, like, this demon is trying to take souls, and that's one way to take someone's soul, by them taking their own life. Hold on, hold on, guys. I was watching a video last night, and it came up with that Hematos thing. Is it a coincidence that Hematos has appeared in two YouTube videos within the same week? I don't know. It's very strange, isn't it? But yeah. I don't know. Do they seem to band about the same... The same words, the same alleged demon all over the place. Yeah, but that is very much a coincidence uh, that I watched a video last night and it allegedly had that hematos alleged demon on it. Yeah, that, that was very weird. Yeah, it seems to pop up. Is that the, the N word these days? I don't know. I've never heard of hematos before, so I can't really say. Thank it's you. It's music. Okay. You were asking, can you give us a sign? Can you do that again? Can you play the music again? If it's true that you ended up taking your life up here. Thank you. We're so sorry that you felt like you had to do that. We're sorry that that's what it came to. Just one. I feel like that was like an acknowledgement of like, yeah, it's okay. Mm -hmm. Dude. Can you make the music box go off? If you were feeling an oppression here, if you think something demonic here maybe affected you and made you take your own life. I like the atmosphere. The atmosphere is good. It's kind of got you... It's like the hairs in your back of your neck stand up. Very good. Yes. That is crazy. Is that demon, is that thing that caused you to do that, is that the same evil entity that was affecting us earlier? Yes. Oh my god. I have the chills, dude. Is this demonic presence still oppressing you today? Is this demonic presence downstairs right now? Or is it Cock and Bill's story? Yes. Okay, so it's downstairs. Yes. Yes. Thank you so much. Oh, dude, I am literally so chilled up right now. Same. Can you make this device go off again if you're the one that people hear up here dragging furniture? Yes, dude, this is so direct. And uh, just for reference again, the music box is pointed that direction. Oh my God. Thank you. Can I know anyone explain that? Okay, well we've answered a lot of questions. I'm not really too sure. Would you I don't know much about the music box. So I can't really say so it either way. see you with our own eyes? I guess not much happens there. That's where the fast forward did it. Makes sense, doesn't it? This is weird. She was like talking with us directly, back and forth, back and forth. And for some reason, she's just gone silent. Can you step out of your hiding and make the music box go off one more time? Maybe she's a bit fed up with the song, you know. Maybe one wants a different song. Too. It just went right <clears throat> once. Is the demon up here right now? Is that why you've kind of gone quiet? Yes. Yes. So 
So the demon's up here right now. Is what you're like I said before, I don't know. Is this the power of suggestion? Just to see if I, can I don't know. Anything up here. It'll be weird anyway. Can you step in front of the flashing light and make yourself known? Are you standing next to Alex? Notice how the music he looks very bored, inside. doesn't he? Alex looks so bored in that picture. Oh my god. <laughs> Okay, I think she's still here she's for sure. Still here. Can you step in front of the music box? That camera he was using, is that like a, a phone he was using or is it a proper camera? To me, it just looks like it's a phone he's using. Not really a proper camera, so. Maybe it would have been better if he used a proper camera in these instances instead of his mobile phone. Just a thought, my friends, just a thought. Anyway, let's see what else happens in this one. Okay, no, nothing on the photographs. <clears throat> if you're hiding, that's okay. We appreciate that you came out to talk to us. Oh gosh, I'm just all sorts of creep. I'm guessing we're now going into the attic. Or the barn, I mean. We've already this been to the attic. Sorry. So creepy. Yeah, I don't like this at all. Hold on. Do you smell it? Does it smell like burning? Burning. Charles, it smells like burning right now. Sorry, it's a barn, my friends. Usually barns do smell that way. So the wood, is it not? Is that not what wood smells like? It kind of smells like burning at times, doesn't it? It's a barn, like I said before. So yeah, I think I've maybe debunked that one. Do, do you think I'm right there? Well, anyway, let's continue, but I think I'm right, and that's the most important thing. <laughs> yep, smell like burning. burning. Okay, I make sense, don't I? Like Not really. Right you smell that? Yes, 100%. Alright, let's start this wide. Let's get into it. Oh this is so creepy. Oh, there's like a freaking ram head behind us. Is there? Oh, yeah. I don't really like that being behind us, but. Nice touch there, the wee ram head, you know? Mm, adds a wee bit of spooky atmosphere to proceedings. So, right now we are in the barn. The barn is known to have like this seven foot tall entity that apparently is more apt to communicate or interact with women, specific women. One thing we do know is that it doesn't like people in its space. And now we are hunkered down here, right in the center of it all. We know that we are entering- There we go, adding a little bit of exposition there. Right nice, nice, nice. We are temporarily here. Um, Planting the seeds to a story to that might come up later on. What, is... what the hell was that? That was right behind the camera. Hello? Hey, uh, how are you doing? I'm here. Are you here? Trying to figure out what is... What the hell was that? Trying to figure out what is... What the hell was that? Just a wee bang, that's all. It's an old building. If Creaks and bangs will always happen. Here, which I feel like there is. Can you tap once if you're okay with us being here? And twice if you want us to get out. Yo, there's like a Ouija board uh, made of wood. No way. In other words, nothing happened. A Ouija board drawn on the wood on the ground. That just must stir up everything. That's what I'm saying. Like I have to say, at least they didn't try to ham up that uh, nothing really happened there. So that's a good thing about this video, I'm guessing and rituals, right? You have crucifixes and Christianity scattered throughout. It's like a melting pot of clashing forces. Which is why it's so aggressive and so dark, as it's constantly in a warfare of like trying to control this place. More stories, more exposition. Nice, nice, nice. Or you do not see a crucifix. Oh my goodness, good point. 
All right, well, I'm going to turn on the PS device. Is there anybody here with us right now? You can use this device. You can select a word to communicate with us. Is there anybody here right now? God. God. Said God. You're just saying that there's no crucifix in here. It's almost like it was like mocking me. In other words, we're trying to make that word more relevant than you? what it is. Come on. Can you tell us why you're in this space? Blood. Blood. Violent. Violent. Violent and blood? I mean, that just sounds like a pagan ritual. We just asked, why are you here? Like... Do you think that this seven foot tall shadow was brought here with one of these rituals? And the reason why it's in this shed is because there is no crucifix? That is such a creepy thing to say, but it makes sense. Do you want violence? Do you want blood? You really want it to say yes, don't you? You really do. I'm so curious on what this seven foot tall thing is. Company. 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 Are we in your company now? Are you with us? Fear. Fear. No way. Do you want us to yes, fear you? Yes, it's Project no Fear. The thing I'm still confused about is the fact that this seven foot tall thing has an affinity for women. That is weird. And it's certain women. This is like one of the cases where I'm totally fine not fitting someone's type. Oh! Hello? Okay, what the uh, actual shit was kind that? Kind of sounds like footsteps there. Like a slam door. Is there anybody there? I can see back there and I don't see anything. So do you think there was a slam there or do you think that was maybe put into the video to make it sound a wee bit more scary than what it really was? In other words, do you think they had a wee bit of mischief involved in it? I don't really know. Was it done in post-editing? Who knows? Anyway, uh, they'll know. Let's continue anyway. One of the cases where I'm totally fine not fitting someone's type. Oh! Hello? I have to say, it does sound like it does come from the room, so I don't know. What do you think that was? Was it maybe something falling? Why do you Could have, have been something falling. Women? Describe yourself. God. God. Again. Describe yourself. And it said God again. It's the second time it's described itself as God. Like the fact it said the same word twice. Right. Sacrilege. Sacrilege? What is- No that? way. Dude, it just said sacrilegious. Hematos. Hematos! Hematos and sacrilegious? Chelsea, that's not good. Sacrilegious? Are you kidding me? And hematos. Hematos, a demon that steals souls. And sacrilegious. Anybody else finding this a little bit far-fetched and very convenient that these things seem to be coming out at the exact same time? Very strange, isn't it? Yeah, I don't know if I'm believing this or not. Makes a good video, makes good entertainment, makes a good story, I guess, but yeah. I don't really know. I don't really know. What are you all thinking? Thinking uh, this is real? You're thinking this is fake? Or do you not really care? You're just here for the entertainment. I don't blame you if you are just here for the entertainment. I would be too. Are you kidding me? And hematos. Hematos, a demon that steals souls and sacrilegious. I feel icky. I feel like this isn't good. Who's icky? Who's what? icky? I thought I saw something, I swear to God. Okay, I think we gotta get out of here. I'm actually freaked out. I feel like we're in, like, this is the time where something's gonna happen.
She puts the fear in project. See what I've done there, guys? See what I've done? Like, I never say that, but like, I think we figured it out. If it's not a demon, it is trying its best to act like a demon. Maybe we try the spirit box now? Yeah. We did use the spirit box in part one here at the Ancient Ram Inn, and we were getting a lot of really weird responses. We got something to call you out by name twice. Oh, I hate that device. It's so freaking annoying. It doesn't do anything. It just picks up radio waves, that's all it is. I heard a voice there. I something. Who's the male voice for hearing? How can you hear a voice? It's just radio waves, come on. It doesn't make any sense. Our names from earlier. Can you say one of our names? the girl still up here? The, the girl you're just talking to? Can you say something? So the girl is a him. Okay. Are you with That's us? That's very right now? nowadays, isn't it? With us? <laughs> I heard a laugh. Yeah. I wanted to have to rewind that, I didn't hear a laugh at all. you say something? Oh, I've made me rewind a bit too far. Are you with us right now? Is this demon with us? I didn't hear a laugh there at all. Uh, I heard uh, mixed uh, radio waves there, mixed channels. That's not a laugh. It's like you're you're searching for a radio station. It just picks up something, then it drops. That's what that was. It's not a laugh. Come on. God. Definitely said God. What about God? It's a war. It's, it's a war? war? It's a war? It's a war. What about God? It's a war. I thought it was all... I thought, I it, thought was... it was all... You thought it was all what? Sorry, I'm just not buying this at all, my friends. Not buying this at all. Um, they're just the... Uh, Voices from the radio waves or radio stations, isn't it? It's it's nothing more, nothing less. They're just picking up radio stations, just wee bits of the radio station. Yeah, they're just making things up. These guys, aren't they? It's not real. This stuff, obviously, the the spirit box and all that. It's not real. This this wee device they're using. It's not real at all. It's all pseudoscience. Yeah, like I said, they're just picking up radio waves, radio stations, just wee snippets, and that's where the voices are coming from. I really do not like when people take these devices that these teams use so seriously because there's there's no science behind it. It's, for me, it's just gullible people that are falling for these sort of things. And that's why these devices are such a high price. You know, there's always profit to be made when there's gullible people about. Sad to say, isn't it? But it's true. You know her at all. I mean, she was... It seemed like she was hiding mm -hmm. once this demonic entity came up here. Now it's just male voices. Just male voices. And dude, I cannot believe it brought up God mm -hmm. and then a war. Mm -hmm. Like, I think that is 100% what is happening, is there's some sort of spiritual warfare here. I mean, think about this. All, there's so many crucifixes here, but there's also an equal amount of, like, really evil stuff here. There's weird occult stuff here. Yeah. <sighs> You said Alex's name earlier and that you're going to haunt him. Do you still stand by that? With you, with you. With you. Yeah, I've been here with you. Is there something about me that you don't like?
Dude, was that a man saying run? Yes. It kind of sounded like a woman, but yeah, I don't really believe that for a second. Find them. Oh my what god. What the fuck, dude? That is a weird voice, too. That is terrifying. All it is, is your brain just trying to make sense of the words that are coming through. Even if there's no sense to be made at all. That's all it is. We should be here. We shouldn't be here. We should be here or we shouldn't be here? I think it said we shouldn't be here. Whoa! Did we Hello? Sh we shut the door. That was a loud crash. The cops the coming in <laughs> to see what's happening. Did y'all see Tanner? <laughs> There's been phone calls. The police are coming. As I powered down the music box for a second, there was a crash. That could have been either the witch's room or the bishop's room. But it sounded like it was a floor below us. Maybe somebody was bashing the bishop a wee Whoa. bit too loud. See what I did there, guys? See what I did there? I made a funny. It wasn't that funny, though, was it? Not really. Anyway, let's continue. Did we Hello? Sh we shut the door. Are you coming up here? Whoever that was, can you come up here and talk to us? Where do you want us to go? That's not the attic. Is there a room you want us in? I guess they're not very talkative, are they? Said the witches. What room? The witches? The witches room? There's only a couple rooms they could have said. Bishop, witches, barn, kitchen. Those are like the that's four it. rooms. Yeah, that's quite the a coincidence, witches. actually. That that's is quite a coincidence, isn't place. it? There's something yeah, that seems that to have came up. There's something dark about that room. You want us to go to the witches room? getting freaked out about nothing at all aren't they they're getting freaked out about nothing it's quite funny watching them these teams are all full of bravados most of the times aren't they and they, they go into these areas and yeah they pretend to be scared that's what i think anyway i used to like this team as well i used to like them i used to watch their tv show all the time but um it got cancelled i think there was some sort of drama behind it all but i don't really know i need to look into it sometime maybe i'll make a video about it sometime who knows? Would that be a good idea? Do you think I should? Possibly will, my friends. I possibly will. Dude, that sounded like a girl saying, he sees you. He sees you. Like, he sees you. I'm here. I'm here. I'm like getting really wobbly right now. Yeah, same. Like, I just noticed my hand was doing this, and like, I'm like wobbling. Is maybe his okay? blood sugar level yeah, down a wee really bit? Maybe he needs something here. to eat? Like dizzy? Is he ate yeah. all day? Has he had anything to eat, I wonder? This, before. <sighs> this is not good. This is a location that people get severely affected at. Something feels like it's just grabbing the back of my brain. Are you affecting Alex? It's good entertainment, that's why he's getting affected. Like, I truly feel like this is the most demonic place we've ever been to. That was, I think, the creepiest PS device session we've ever done. <clears throat> I wonder if we break out a different device. So this is called the Envoy. 
It is said that spirits are able to manipulate this device. We're gonna ask yes or no questions and it's gonna be able to select an answer. Put this right here. Were you conjured here? Were you brought here? Yes! Yes! It said yes. Oh my God. It was brought here. Was this shadow figure brought here because of the rituals? Are you okay with us being in here right now? At least it doesn't respond all the time, no. so... Right there. I've never seen this machine before. So this is a new one on me. Us being in this space, which I feel like we both felt that. So what do you think so far? I think I need a, another whiskey soon, you know? To deal with this bill crap. Would you say I'm enjoying this? Mm, hard to say. If we dug, would we find bodies underneath this building? Yes. yes. No way. There's no way in hell they would have any permission to do that. Not a chance. Yes, yes. again. No way. I'm freaked out. No way, Charles. I'm going to just ask the same question that we got a no to just to make sure. Are you okay with us being here right now? No! Oh my god! No way! I did that just to make sure that what we were talking to would give us like the same answer. Is it bad if we stay? Well, it's good entertainment, this doesn't it? Is it real? I'm highly Are dubious. You a demon. I have to say, at least then they're showing that they don't always get results from their machines, so that's always something. Yeah, strange video. I feel like we need yeah. like a break. I'm gonna call Dakota and Alex and just check in. You need a break? Why you not have a Kit Kat? I feel like dizzy, like vertigo. That's weird. Like like the move is, the dude, I'm even getting confused. Like the room is moving around me. Okay, this is weird. Like wobbling right now. And something said yeah when I said are you affecting Alex? Yeah. I feel like I'm at the beginning stages of like Could be the power of suggestion. Really mm, if you thought about that maybe. I hate this, dude. I hate this place too, dude. Like I don't feel normal right now at all. Yet he continues. Why do they not have a break? Why do they not have a break? Very strange. Go again. Hey, um, we're getting pretty creeped out down here. Uh, okay. how long are we gonna be down here for? We'll come down and get you guys in a couple minutes. All right, sounds good. Holy crap, that scared me. Fuck. Dude, you okay? I don't know. I Why really not give know. the poor guy a little break? Come on. Not very nice, is it? He's obviously feeling the effects of something. What with Maybe he needs something to eat. Three times we got the same response. What did it say? We were basically inquiring, like, what entity is here, and it responded twice with the word God. Dude. Yeah. What the hell? It said God on our spirit box. No, ah, oh, dude. <sighs> Maybe they've picked up the same radio station. Hmm, is it maybe some kind of religious station they found? There's something so evil here. This is definitely not something I'm comfortable interacting with. Like, I got super dizzy and lightheaded. It's gonna get to a point that something horrible happens and it's gonna be a no-duh, you guys should have left the moment. The only thing that we didn't figure out an answer to is like why the entity is more focused and more interactive with women. I do have an idea for putting that to the test. You might not like it, Charles, but I will remind I think we'll like it though, wouldn't we? Mm. Made me go alone What's going to happen? To look for a rubber duck. I'm thinking us three guys go up to like the bishop's room and continue asking questions, but you stay in the barn. 
That is not what I was getting at. Maybe if you stay in here, we'll get an answer. Maybe we don't have to put everything to the test at the expense of your sister. But I mean, you sent me in a castle looking for ducks. I'm sending you to a barn looking for demons. Comment below if this is fair. It's a fair trade. <laughs> Good luck. Frick. You got it. I'm a little, uh, I'm super happy about it. Yep. I'm a little bit pissed off. Uh, yeah, this is bad. This is bad. This is bad. But it's good. You know, like the saying, like, fuck around and find out. Mm -hmm. That's how I feel, like, what we're doing. Damn, I don't like being back in here. This is literally what they say is the most haunted room in this entire place. This is where the rumor satanic worshiping happened was right here in this room. This is where people have experienced the incubus and the succubus. Boys. And the bashing so the bishop is... ...to possibly experience the succubus, so... <laughs> what do you say? So everybody... So everybody... <laughs> Come on, boys. <laughs> Suddenly their fear had disappeared, didn't it? With potentially a scary entity who pries on specific women and I just hope that I do not fit his type. The REM pod is on. This is sitting so close to me that if it goes off that means something is very close to me. What do you think is going to happen? Anything exciting could happen, do you think? Hmm. What the f***? Genuinely, the floor just like creaked next to me. Like it creaked. It's an old building. Of course the floorboard would creak. It's very old. What the f***? What the f***? I do not invite you into my space if you want to tell I thought my space had shut down. Come on, Facebook took that over, did they not? Yes, it did. People coming into your space, I understand that. But my brother put me here. He's upstairs in the bishop's room. If you want to uh, hash that out, I'm cool with that. I'm going to turn on the PS device. Is there anybody here in this room with me right now? I wonder how many rats are in that building. How many rats are in that barn, do you think? Because you've got to bear in mind that all the creaking and that goes on, it's probably just... Crucifix! I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, it's crucifixes, yeah. It's probably just like animals walking about. This is crazy. To prove that you're in here with me, can you describe something about me so I know that you are actually communicating with me? Well, you, you can be quite annoying at times. Hmm. Describe. Describe. Yes, describe me. Attitude. I asked to describe a word about me and it said attitude. Can you describe something else about me? She's not happy that it said she's got an attitude. Whoa. Something could happen soon. Let's hope it does because it brings some excitement to this video, wouldn't it? Serve. Spirits. Within. Serve spirits within. It's a pub. That's what it is, it's a pub. Serving spirits within. Are you in here? Wrong. Wrong. Enough. Enough. Noise. Noise.
I think we should try the digital recorder while we're in here. We haven't tried this yet tonight. This is just a recording device that picks up frequencies our ears can't hear. And it's believed that this can capture spirit voices. All right, I'm gonna set this on the bed so no one's touching it. There'll be no interference. Can I ask who actually says it picks up spirit's voices? I've not heard that. You can speak and we will be able to hear you. Do you have a message for us? Were you part of the satanic rituals that were done in this room? And nothing really happens. You know, look at that. I've nearly finished my whiskey already. It shows um, how much whiskey I've drank, I guess. <laughs> it shows how exciting this video's been. How long have you been here for? Is this house truly demonic? Surely that's just interference. There's definitely something there. After how long have you been? Like I said, surely that's just interference, isn't it? I've been here, and then I can't make out what it says after. How long have you been here for? Surely that's just interference. Well, I can't hear. I've been here. I can't hear that at all. I've been here, like it's answering us. But then there's like a couple words after I cannot make out. Like I said before. This is all to do with the power of suggestion. I can't make that one out. <clears throat> I don't know. I don't think the follow the words after that are clear enough to like say for sure. Well, we definitely yeah. That I've been here seems to be clear. No, I didn't hear. I've been here. I heard. Ar, ar, ar. Viewers that was not. I've been here. Come on. Makes sense. Let's keep playing the rest and see if there's anything else there. Is this house truly demonic? Oh my god. Oh, oh my god. god. I hear demonic. Do you play that again? It literally answers you. There's like a whisper or something before. All I hear is. <laughs> That's all. I don't hear anything else. Like, I hear the monic part for sure. That's so weird. Like, it's confirmed. I just yeah, hear interference. That's all I hear. Yeah. But to hear that. I guess my ears aren't very good then. The voice. Yeah, the voice. That is a creepy voice, too. Yeah. Dude, one more time, Demonic. please. That's insane. I'm sorry, they seem very, very calm after hearing a voice saying it's demonic. That's kind of a dead giveaway, isn't it? That the thing that they're doing is not really real. They don't like it either. Over. There. Over there? Are you looking at me right now? Are yes. you across the room? Yes. That is why there's a couple of cameras there. We're all looking at you. It's like far away from me, like it's keeping its distance from me. Shadow. Shadow. No way. Sorry, is Shadow said, not the enemy of Sonic the Hedgehog? Shadow here. He sure he is. Can you tell me who that Shadow is? The Shadow is Sonic's enemy, that's who it is. I've been sitting next to this REM pod for nearly an hour. If you are here, can you make this device go off? All you have to do is come close to it. And nothing happens. What the fuck? 
for Rick. This door just like creaked open. Did it though? Did it really creak open? I didn't see it opening. She's just thinking it did. That door just actually sounded like it was gonna open. There we go, she corrected herself. She, it sounded like, but it never did. It's possibly wind outside or animals. That was terrifying. Is there a reason why you particularly affect women? Bed. Bed. That's creepy. His. His. Gently. Gently. Hold. Hold. Call them McGregor. You like to see women sad. Do you feed off of depression? You can tell it's the, it's getting close to morning because all the birds are out now. Yeah, the the dawn oh, chorus, the as they call it. Yeah, the sun is coming up. Oh man. Yeah. I think. Let's just go back to Chelsea, but on our way, let's stop in the witch's room. Just ask a couple questions. I think at this point they're trying to get as much content as possible because they've not really caught anything, have they? Sad, really sad. I know Alex and me and you were in the attic and we said, where should we go? We told us the witch's. Yeah, dude. The witch's room. So whoever's in here, we're going to leave here very, very soon. Can you move something in here? Can you use your voice? Something? There's a Ouija board here on the table. Can you play with the Ouija board? She needs to be a lot of Ouija boards in this place, isn't there? Can anybody see the duck? Is there a duck hiding in this room? And this is just our second stop on She's this She's pretty trip. scared, isn't she? We've got a lot of road trip left, so... <laughs> I think we should pack it up and get out of here. We made it out. Nice job. We freaking did it. I know. I don't feel that accomplished, to be honest. I just feel lucky to get out of here without anything too bad happening. This place is evil. This place is demonic. This place just harbors bad energy. Something in that house was oppressing me. Something was targeting me the entire night. So that'll be that then, I guess, yeah. What do you think of that video? Did you enjoy it? Did you thought it was real? Did you think it was amazing? For me, I thought it was actually quite boring to tell you the truth. Nothing really happened in it, did it? There's no evidence. It's all just the power of your mind and the power of suggestion. Yeah, for me it's, nah, nothing happened. To, they didn't prove anything, so yeah. But still, I'd like to go to that place someday. The ancient Ram Inn. Yeah, I would love to visit that place, but yeah. I think I'll have to do a wee bit more research into it before I actually head there, you know, because I don't know, a lot of things allegedly happen there, but when you get allegedly real investigators, nothing happens, so yeah. Is it just YouTubers? I don't know. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed. Hey, if you did enjoy the content, why not like, comment and subscribe, my friends. And until next time, I shall catch you later. Thank you for watching the video. I really hope you enjoyed it. What did you make of it? Was it scary? Did you think it was a load of rubbish? Were you afraid? Anyway, I thought it was quite decent. Could have been better though. Could have been a lot better. Anyway, here are some other videos that might pique your interest. Until next time. I shall scare you later.